Greetings to all my friends that are listening to this program today. I thank you so much for tuning into this broadcast. Hope you're having a great day. The Lord is good to us. I want to talk to you from the book of Jude today. I want to go over three scriptures. And one scripture is found, Beloved, Paul said, I would like to, I would love to come talk, talk to you about the faith and talk about common salvation in verse 3. It was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that you should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints. You know, that earnestly contend is just about in every translation where you read, which means simply that we've got to fight for our faith. You know, the devil tr will try to store our faith. That's one thing he really works hard on is trying to destroy our faith. And we should earnestly contend for our salvation. And thank God for that wonderful thing. There's all kinds of things that try to interfere with our relationship with God. But thank God we can earnestly contend. And then there's a couple of the scriptures. In verse 20 it says, But ye, beloved, building yourself up in the most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost. You need to build up your faith, and building your faith is studying the Word of God. And then it goes on to say there, pray in the Holy Ghost. That's a real effective way to pray, praying in the Holy Ghost and the Spirit. Some people want to say the Holy Spirit, but pray in the Holy Spirit. But I like to just do what the King James Version says, so pray in the Holy Ghost. And then it says, the next verse, keep yourself in the love of God. That's something we have to really do all the time. We need to contend that we honestly uh, forget all those things that's going on in our life, and we need to keep ourselves in the love of God. But you know, God is love, and we're looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ unto eternal life. Folks, as we deal with things that are going on today, there are so many things going on in the world that will try to destroy your faith. Every kind of philosophy that you can think of is coming up today. We, we're dealing with all kinds of things today that tries to destroy your faith. But folks, the Bible, the Word of God is true. It is a wonderful Word of the living God. You can believe it and you can stand up on it, and one day it will take you to heaven if you follow the Lord and His precepts. And, and also keeping yourself in the love of God. God is a God of love, and remember, we have to do everything in love, and let us not forget that. And praying in the Holy Ghost, and that's a good thing, looking for our Lord Jesus Christ unto eternal life. Folks, if we're faithful, we're going to have an eternal life forever. That means we'll have a new body. And I appreciate you listening today. Thank you so much. This is Raymond Mayfield, and I'll talk to you again real soon.